Hey guys, it's Gay Gay. Welcome back to my channel. This is today's look. Please excuse the allergy eyes. They won't let me be great. Now this is an inspired look. And if you're interested in how I did this look, just stay tuned, watch the video, hit like, hit subscribe. Let's be people. And I hope you enjoy. Okay, guys. So today's look is an inspired look. Now, I know that I do these cat eyes all the time with glitter. But this look is inspired because I was on her channel. And her name is Fumi Desvalaud. I was on her channel where she was promoting her new... Um, eyeshadow palette with Juvia's Place. And so she did this blue glitter cat eye and the way that that blue hit that melanin was like, whoa, it was gorgeous. So it just inspired me. Now I probably did a blue cat eye somewhere down the line, I'm sure, but here's another one. So I'm going to go into my Milani blue eyeshadow. This is about the deepest blue that I have. So I'm gonna use this one and I'm going to fill in my cat eye with that. So I'm just placing my brush. Let's see if I can scoot up. Every time I try to scoot up, I hit the camera. Okay, so I'm just gonna fill this in first. Just so when I place my glitter, if I have some gaps, it won't look, it won't look bad. And then plus I traced it with this black. So I've got to get that off of there some kind of way. I usually just go in with a pencil and do it, but today I did it with that black liner because I needed I couldn't really see that pencil and I needed to see to at least get as straight as possible. So I'm just gonna fill this in. Yeah, and kind of take it over this black so we can. I made me a cut crease brush from an old brush that Domingue had, old brush, a paint brush Domingue had, and I could have sworn when I washed my brushes, I put that brush right in that middle brush set, and I can't even find it now. I mean, I just, and I really need that right now, because that would help me to get right in this crease not in the crease but right on this edge here you know what i'm saying i mean just this alone without the glitter look at that man that's something about blue and melanin oh baby now i've already got my um foundation on because i did a video earlier today which i don't know if i'm gonna put that up or not because i, I wasn't exactly happy about the lighting the way the sun kept coming in and it was messing up my life was just ugh, too much. So I don't know yet, but that's why I have on my foundation. I'll probably end up having to redo it because, well, as you can see, I've got visitors. But yeah. So yeah, we're filling in this cat eye. Ooh, that's pretty by itself. <laughs> On the real, though. Okay, so I decided to mix my glitter, three glitter. So I mixed the blue, the black, and the purple together. Instead of just doing a complete blue eye, let's add some color and do a little something. Let's see what so I'm going get. in with this eyelash glue, and I usually don't use glue on my glitter, especially when I'm not going anywhere, but... I'm going to do it on this one because I really think I need it. And it wasn't really bad the last time I used the glue. I didn't have to pull and tuck that bad. Because that's basically why I don't like to do it. I don't like to pull and tuck on the skin. <laughs> Girl, when you get in the 50s, you be trying to preserve. You heard me. All right. So I placed my glue. And now I'm going to go in and place my glitter. Oh, yeah. I knew that was going to be good. <laughs> Harpo, who that be? Who that be, Harpo? Look at that. Oh, my goodness. Can, is the camera picking this up? Because, baby, that purple and blue with a little bit of black is like, oh, <sighs> make 
make you say, oh. If I could sing, I'd sing a song for you. You hear? All right, so that's what we're doing. We're going to place some more glue. And then I can glitter everywhere. I have OCD, and so I will stop a whole video and clean this so I can't do it. I can't do it. So I'm placing my glue. So happy new year. Oh my goodness. It's a new year. Y'all, I'm not trying to be a, a Debbie Downer. I'm really not. It's, um, I mean, anybody with a name like gay, you, you're a happy person. <laughs> but I just, you know, my daughter was telling me that it is a mutated version of this COVID-19. I'm like, how is it mutated? It, it's, it's, the coronavirus has been around for years, yes. But all of a sudden, it's done mutated in a year to a whole nother level. I, I, this, this is not making sense to me. It, it, that's just not making sense now. Come on. I, woo! This glitter is just breathtaking. I hope it's as pretty on camera as it is in person. Baby, I'm telling you the truth. This make me want to go somewhere. Oh, this is gorgeous. But yeah, she's telling me that it has mute. It's a whole nother. Oh my goodness. Mutation of this. That the vaccine, it was not, it was, you know, not prepared for. So it's like, how is 2021 going to be now? I mean, it's a whole new strand of this. Oh, my goodness. Y'all, this is like we're living in a freaking movie. I try not to think about it because I don't want to get scared and just, just you know, trip myself out because it ain't nothing I can do about it. But what I've always had to do in life was pray and believe God to take care of me because I don't have no sense. But I tell you, it's just, oh my goodness. See, this is why I don't do my makeup first because, honey, you don't never know what, you just don't know. Look at this, all this glitter all on my face. Now I've got to take this foundation off and redo it. And I had no intention of doing that. <laughs> Whew, I was hoping I wouldn't have to anyway. But look at that. Oh, my goodness, Becky. Look at this eye. Stunning. Stunning. That glitter mixed together is what is just, whoa. I wish I had, I wish I could put a black liner. I really do. But I know I can't get it off that glitter. All right, then. Let's do the other eye. Okay, guys, so both eyes are done. I'm going to go in with the Ur Dream Urban Cover by Maybelline. I got this foundation months ago to try it, and I ain't even used it. So it's too red, but, you know, you know we make it work. So I'm going to go and place that on and while my lashes are drying, because I wanted to do the big 3D lashes, but I think with the glitter, it's already, you know, stand out-ish. And then the big, I think that'll be too much. You know, not for me, but, you know. <laughs> so, I'm going to go with regular lashes. I really don't want to, but I think it'll look better. So yeah, let's finish up this foundation and contour, and then we'll finish working on the eyes because I think I want to go underneath with glitter and just see how they look. I hope I don't mess up the whole look by doing that because once it's done, it ain't no taking it off until you take it off. You know what I mean? So... Wish me luck. Hey guys, I'm going to go in with the NYX pencil in my eyes. 
on my wet line and let's pray that these allergies do not start. Oh my goodness, don't start. And I'm thinking about going on top of that white with this blue. Now remember this palette is a um, paint stick palette. It's not made to go inside of your eye. So if you do it, you do it at your own. Hmm. Yes or no? Uh, no. I don't think that looks good. Let's stick with We're going to go underneath our eyes with this blue. And I'm, I'm thinking I'm going to put some glitter on that. I'm gonna put some glitter on top of this. I'm think I don't know. I don't know if that'll just be too much. I mean, I don't really care about too much. I just want it to look good. I am too much, so I don't have a problem with that. I don't wanna get it on there and then I don't like it. But you never know until you try. You know what I'm saying? So, we're going to try some glitter. On underneath. Okay, so, we're going underneath the eye with the eyelash glue. Mm. Okay. And we've, we're going back into our glitter. You know what? I should wet this brush first. <sighs> wet, wet it with this NYX. Okay. Now, let's go in with the glitter. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. This eye is trying to water up. You better stop it if you think you're going to make a profit. Okay. It's not bad. All right. Okay. I wish I hadn't put the glitter underneath too, but it's done now. Uh, I'm going to go in with this lip gloss and just line my lips. This is my favorite lip liner, and it's it's over with. And it's the uh, Salt and Pepper collaboration with Milani. It is done. But we are still hanging on. Okay, guys, and this is the completed look. I love this look. I love this glitter is what I like. I like this blue and the purple and the black mingled together. And in person, I don't know if you can really see it that well on camera, but in person, the purple really mingles in and peeks out through the blue. It's really stunning. Now, I do wish I hadn't put it up under the eyes because I don't like that. I was debating about whether or not it would look good. I hoped it would, but yeah, I should have followed my first mind and I did that, but it's done now. And plus my allergies are trying to kick up. That's nothing new. But anyway, guys, this is the inspired look. And I just, I just love those colors together. I just want to go somewhere, but I ain't going to do it. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed the video. Please hit like, hit subscribe. Let's be peoples, and I will holler at you. Be safe.